I'm Jason Samanow with the Capital Weather Gang, and we are tracking Harvey, which is likely to make landfall in East Texas on Friday night as a major hurricane. That's Category 3 or stronger with maximum sustained winds of 115 miles per hour. If it does in fact make landfall as a Category 3, it will be the first storm to do so on U.S. soil since Wilma hit Florida in 2005. And it is also likely to be the first hurricane to hit Texas since Ike in 2008. Now this storm has multiple hazards we're concerned about. First and foremost is the rain. This storm is going to make landfall around Corpus Christi or thereabout and then sit and stall over the same area for three, four, maybe five days, maybe through the middle of next week. Rainfall potential is up to 20 to 30 inches in some areas, which could lead to very serious life-threatening flooding, even catastrophic flooding. We can't pinpoint exactly where the heaviest rain will fall, but a very large area of eastern Texas is under the gun for extremely heavy rain. A second major hazard of concern is the storm surge, which is a rise in water levels along the coast just north and east of where the center makes landfall. We could see the seas rise 6 to 10 feet above normally dry land that would inundate roads, some businesses, and some homes. Finally, the wind. Maximum sustained winds are forecast to reach 115 miles per hour as the storm comes ashore. That will cause power outages and potentially damage to businesses and homes. So a lot of factors coming together, which makes this potentially a very serious storm in Texas. For anyone in East Texas, you should be starting to prepare right now. And stay tuned to the Capital Weather Gang for the latest updates.